Okay, so what you're going to want to do is just simply head over to azure.microsoft.com. And if you don't have a free account, just go ahead and sign up for a free account. I believe you get like a month for free. And at the time of this recording anyway, $200 in free resources, if you will, free spending on your Azure accounts. So that's pretty cool. It kind of allows you to evaluate the services in some level of depth before uh, perhaps using them for a larger project. So what I'm going to do is just click on portal and I'm just going to go ahead and sign in. So you'll be brought to this dashboard page and you can see the resources that I've created previously for the demo here. Um, and so we're going to go ahead and create some resources now for this project. So if you'll see on the left side of the screen here, we're going to click on storage accounts. And of course I can't guarantee that the UI here will be the same at the time that you're watching this video. But if anything changes, I'll try to go ahead and add those changes to uh, the course notes. So anyway, you can see that I've got this previous uh, Lambda Forms demo storage account. Now what we're going to do is go ahead and create a new one. And so if you click Add, then I'm just going to create a new one here. And the account kind will be Blob Storage. With standard performance, we'll leave the replication here the same. Access tier will be hot. You'd set it to cool if you were going to do something like database backups or I don't know, something of that nature. In this case, since we're going to be accessing profile images quite frequently, we'll set it to hot here. And for our purposes, we'll disable secure transfer required. I guess if you're on HTTPS, then you might want to have this enabled. And of course, we're using a free trial here. And then I'm going to go ahead and create a new resource group. And then just go ahead and use the location that makes the most sense for you or your users. And we'll select pin to dashboard as well and now just create. So this will take just a few minutes or maybe a minute or so. And while it's deploying, you'll have this little animation on your dashboard. 